Hello there everybody and how's it going? My name is Harna and welcome back to a channel update slash scheduling announcement whatever the fuck that these videos tend to go in determined directions because in all honesty there is no direction for these types of videos. Honest to God. I'm just gonna be fucking slurring every other day. <laughs> um, but basically I kinda wanted to talk about a little bit of stuff I kinda wanna say. Um, there's gonna be one more of this that's gonna be definitive which is gonna be my Philippine announcement video. And how the duration of how long it's going to be and potentially what to expect if everything goes correctly within the next couple of days. And that's it. Um, there might be one more that's going to be just an update, but who knows. That one is a maybe, but the Philippine trip is going to be a definitive. Uh, that's going to be at the end of the month. So that's going to be a future me and a current me problem. Not the past me because I don't. my past me doesn't give a fuck anymore. But um, to now move over to our scheduling announcement here. So basically, as you can tell right now, a couple of new titles or a bit of new entries have been added in. So 10 a.m. now, Bug Fables, The Everlasting Sapling has now concluded. I finished the game yesterday and it was overly a fun game. And yeah, there was there's nothing much I can say about it. It was just an experience to say the least. Um, I have yet to upload the finale. I'm gonna do it before I leave for work, but I am confident that the game should be wrapping up on the 20th or the 21st of July, depending if there was another video that I recorded. And I kind of gonna leave that right there because there was a there was two videos I forgot to upload. I forgot where the I forget where it went, so I just uploaded it and just, and I just put it as question mark because I generally just don't remember what it was. It, it's not like back chapter three two, but it was like maybe chapter six with going into chapter 7 so I saved myself but I didn't save where it could have been so that's I do apologize on my end for that one but at the same time I forgot about the Bug Fables Private Idol stream so I thought I had it ready to go but I just ended up fucking completely forgetting where everything was at that time I really do need to clean out my fucking desktop to say the least before I leave maybe in September or maybe in August if everything doesn't go in correctly to say the least but um that's basically besides the point right now i kind of now want to talk a little bit more about the other types of games so as you can tell right now buck fables is going to be replaced by guardians crusade for the playstation one by tamsoft now basically i wanted to do a console a console based game because the past uh the past couple of games i've been doing on this channel besides digital devil story megami tensei have been nothing but Steam games, which would also apply why my wallet has been shorter than usual. So, yeah, um, I kind of wanted to take a bit of a step back and kind of want to have the next two games, instead of it being like a Steam game, kind of just go back into a console-based type of vibe. So that's what the game plan is right now. We're going to be doing just the back-to-back -back consoles. I don't know what's going to come out after it, but... I'll kind of take a gander on my mall walk on Monday. So that's going to be something to kind of like lead you guys into. Um, but yeah, um, Guardians Crusade, I did uh, two live streams of the game as well as I recorded one video already. I don't know how long this game is. From what the guide I was reading, I just started part two, The Journey. So I currently don't know how big the game is to say the least because yeah. Um... But yeah, the next game hasn't been decided afterwards, but I'm going to be looking into that beforehand. So yeah, yeah. Uh, moving onwards from Guardians Crusade to Grisaya. I have nothing to say about the series because I'll be honest, right now I'm actually praying to Christ that the series is going to last all the way up until September. Which is, which is going to be a definitive because what it is, but I have, actually it is because uh, there's, there's still a good amount of backlog, backlogging to do. But uh, what I'm going to do, because of the length that this game has been going, because I think I've had this game since fucking... I need to... I'm going to take a gander right now. You're going to get, like, a live... Like, how long has it been since Grisaya fucking 1 has been a thing? Uh, the Fruits of Grisaya 1, where is it, where is it, where is it, where is it? Oh my god, I forgot because I've been changing the titles. This game has been out... I've had this game since 14th of January. So this game has been running for at least six months. So I'm going to make you guys a promise right now when uh, Grisaya ends out, when we wrap up Grisaya, there's going to be maybe three to four AA, AAA titles that's going to come out to kind of like bridge a gap. So 
that is gonna be the definitive promise for the time being. I'll give you guys my, I'll give you my uh, promise that there's gonna be at least three to four games before we go back to Crusader for round two, because there's still arcs, there's still the routes I kind of want to cover. So that is just something I'm gonna give you guys right here and right now. So promise. But now moving onwards from our 10 a.m. slot, we're gonna slip which it slitch it over, slitch it over to our 11 a.m. slot right now, which is magical drop. So as you can tell right now, private eye doll completely done. I have already all the videos ready to go. They're all already on the my video backlogging list right now. The game is gonna be wrapping up on 23rd of July, which is gonna be a Sunday. Now, basically, ever since I first got this game, because I was looking into like a whatever game I wanted to do after. What was the game I had after before then? I'm gonna take a gander. The let's see, the next game. Oh fuck, I didn't do it. Actually, no, I did. After Jumping Flash, I kind of wanted to. I wanted to do something a little bit interesting, and I saw Private Eye Doll. I was like, "What the fuck is this game?" And as soon as I got, the, as soon as I played it, I was like, "This game is fucking amazing. I want to keep playing more of this." And it was like basically nonstop of me recording, like fucking nonstop. It was like a very interesting type of game, and. When you watch the game, it's going to be an amazing experience. I will say that the last case that the, I was at in this game, I fucking kid you not, I had to watch a guide because there was just so much shit that I did not know where to go and my direction was so fucking off. But that's basically all I will say for that one. The last couple of videos are going to be like, I looked a guide up because I just don't know where to go anymore afterwards. So, I will say right now about Private Eye Doll, and I forgot to say about the Bug Fables video, that uh, there's a little bit of content that I want to do with Bug Fables that I kind of want to look into, which is that's going to be a bonus video in its own right, which I keep saying bonus because, uh, fuck me, I, I don't actually make promises on those types of videos. I keep saying it, but I've been, backlog I've been prioritizing more on backlogging a little bit, so I do apologize for that. September, October... I'm I'm gonna get back and I'm gonna be more stricter with those videos than any, anything else before, but um, that's something I'm working on, and Private Eye Doll. There is one bonus video that's basically a I basically left the game running because I had to go cook my breakfast on the finale when I recorded the finale, and uh, I saw that there was like a like something called Maze Green Room, which uh, I kind of want to take a gander at what that is because. I'll leave it at that. I'm going to leave it as it is. Um, I haven't recorded it quite yet because I forgot to, but I did have a safe state at the final con at the final confrontation. So I'm going to kind of like play it again off recording and then just record the aftermath and then we'll go it as it is. So yeah. Um, moving onwards to that or now to get back into Magical Drop. So basically we're going to be doing Magical Drop 2. Um, so originally I wanted to do Gunslinger Girls Volume 2, but I decided, you know what? I'm going to do Magical Drop 2 instead. I'm going to hold Gunslinger Girls Volume 2 for a good bit, and then we'll come back to it at some point. Now, I I am going to make, I had to make a bit of a decision, because I, I wanted to do like maybe another back-to-back -to -back topographic CD, but what I decided to kind of like, re I realized what I should have done, and I kind of regret doing it. I should have not done Private Eye Dolls early. I should have done the other Turbo Graphics CD game that I saw. I do have the game ready to go, but uh, I forgot to. I I kind of wanted to try out Private Eye, so it's on. It's I I apologize on my end for that, but then I kind of wanted. So basically, Magical Job Two is going to be a filler game while I start to get the next game ready to go. Which hopefully the next game. Which I won't say right now, it is a TurboGrafx CD game, that's all I can say. Will basically last me up till September, which hopefully it should, or hopefully it will. There is a sequel. I won't cover the sequel. Have you seen how far I've, com I've done Crash Bandicoot 1? I don't know what I'm doing Crash Bandicoot fucking 2. I don't know. Who knows? But um, now getting back into the seriousness of everything. Um... But yeah, uh, Magical Drop 2, I don't really know how long it's going to go. I did record two characters today, and uh, yeah. A bit of a forewarning, a bit of a forewarning for this uh, game that's coming out, is that uh, I don't know why, I don't know if it's the thing I'm using, but there is no music when I'm playing the game, but the sounds are still active, so I don't know if it's the, the thing itself. But I will say that we're not doing the Super Famicom version of it, 
we're actually playing the Sega Saturn version of it, so I'll leave it at that. We're going to kind of jump a console, but I kind of want to also jump a console again to the PlayStation because I found out there was a magical drop on that console, and I saw an image for it, and I was like, what the fuck? There was a magical drop on PS1? So we might take a look at that as a bonus video, so... I say these things and then might not happen, but maybe the bonus video for Magical Drop might come out. I can be quoted on that. <laughs> but yeah, uh, Magical Drop 2, currently I don't know. I just recorded the pilot video today. So it should be potentially just a very short series to say at least. I know it's going to be very short. But uh, it, I think it's going to be even more shorter because I might be doing two characters for each video. So there you go. Um, but now sliding over from that to our indie puzzling slot right now. So as you can tell right now, Kids Quest. Now Kids Quest, I didn't realize it at the time, but it was a uh, it was an early access game, and then there was I think I mentioned it in the previous update video that the there the, they updated the game again with they added in a fifth level. They added a fifth level, which or the fifth and final level, which I have yet to get to because I'm also I'm currently at the. I'm currently at the one with the trees, to which, let me just say right now, there's there's a puzzle that I'm at right now. I'm going to be honest, the la I've done the first two puzzles already, but I cannot fucking solve the last one. Well, let me say, I did solve it until the last, last, last strip right now. And I had to stop my recording because it was already like 12.25 when it, when I was supposed to be, because I had to leave immediately. But, um... Uh, I, I was trying to record again, but I was just keep I was just getting more frustrated with how the, how the last puzzle is. You'll see it when it comes out. But um, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna abandon that puzzle for the time being. Maybe try to do like a roundup if, when the game gets fully completed. I do kind of want to look. I kind of want to go back into it and kind of try to you know solve it more. Try to get it ready. But at this point, I'm going to I'm gonna kind of like. I'm gonna say fuck that area for the time being. Go go get the other fucking dragon teeth and maybe fight the boss and then move on to the next level. I apologize for that, but I need to kind of I need to push more content to say the least. And I was not getting I was not happy the past two days. I legit have I had I was recording with eight cans of Pepsi and maybe that explain maybe that explains my foul mood lately. But. That's besides the point. Um, I did buy the next game already that's going to come out after Kids Quest is done. So if I manage to finish the game before the early access or wherever the early access ends out, I do have the next game ready to go. So I just bought it. And from what I could gather from what the next game is going to be, it looks to kind of be a kind of a, a love letter to... Or maybe like a good, like some platformers, but it kind of gave me like a, I don't know. For me, this game when I saw the title for it, I thought it gave me a, I thought it was gonna be something like f fucking Frogger or something. But I currently do not know until I get a chance to play it. So yeah. But I think with that being said, then that should basically wrap up this entire update video to say the least. So hope you guys did enjoy it and. Like I said earlier, there's going to be one more definitive that's going to be about the Philippine trip that's coming out. And then maybe one more, maybe in the middle of the month to kind of talk about updates, scheduling, and all that type of shit if whatever it is comes through. So basically, that's all I could say for the time being. But with that being said, uh, also be sure to check out the Twitter account that I still have that I might still be using because that's where I post a bit of small updates onto the scheduling as well. And that's going to be where the main source of where I'm going to be kind of tweeting during my upcoming vacation to the Philippines. So, yeah. Um, with that being said and done, thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, I kind of forgot to talk about live streaming. Oh, well. But uh, with that being said and done, hello there. Or not hello there. Goodbye, everybody. Sayonara. Harida. Uh, I forgot how to say that in Railgun T. I'm going to go back and watch fucking Sir Magical Index.